The shaft lock assembly allows you to lock your rotary tool shaft so you can change the bit. The assembly consists of the lock pin and the retainer. Over time, the pin can wear down and begin to slip. Occasionally, the retainer can break. Replacing the shaft lock assembly is a repair that you can do yourself, and I'm going to show you how. I'll begin by removing the collet and collet nut. Then the collar on the front of the tool. Now I can open up the housing. It's secured with four screws. With the screws removed, now I need to slice through the labels on either side of the tool. Now I can go ahead and lift the motor and switch assembly out of the housing. The lock pin and retainer at the front of the housing. I'll just simply remove them from the housing. Now I can install the new lock pin and the new retainer. As I install the motor back into the housing, I want to make sure that I have the switch lined up with the slot in the housing. Take your time making sure everything is aligned. Once in place, you can replace the side covers. These slide over the brush caps and then the grooves on the side covers align with a tab that runs all the way across the housing. Now reinstall the housing. Once everything's in place and aligned, I'll secure the housing with the screws. And I'll finish up by reinstalling the front collar, the collet, and the collet nut. And now you know how to replace the shaft lock assembly in your rotary tool.